Today, I just want to show you how can you transfer your Instant 360 One Hour uh, 360D or photos to your phone directly without using Wi-Fi. Because for me, the Wi-Fi transfer is extremely slow and it's very frustrating. Coming from Instant 360 One X, when I'm used to the cable transfer, the Wi-Fi transfer is just ridiculous. Um, so I, I actually did a lot of research. I can't seem to find it, but to, but uh, this morning I was actually able to crack the code. So maybe you know already, but I'm going to show it to you anyway. So if you look at my album right now, there's nothing. So uh, right now, uh, so what you need is you need a USB-C adapter. Uh, you can either use something like this one, this guy right here, where you ha you can uh, insert the SD card directly. Alternatively, uh, my uh, Note 10 Plus actually came with some uh, uh, Samsung original USB Type C to USB uh, USB uh, something like this, and I just plug in a uh, SD card reader that uh, uh, behind it, so it, that works as well. So whatever you have, uh, but either way, you will need a SD card reader, and you will need a micro uh, you will need, need a micro USB C adapt uh, adapter. But of course, if you use a uh, old generation device which doesn't use US, micro USB C, you can use uh, uh, micro USB as well. Uh, but again, most importantly, is you need a card reader. So what you want to do is that you want to. So right now on my phone, I already have my SD card inserted uh, in a card reader into this uh, Samsung Samsung USB adapter. So what you want to do is go to my file. And then go to the SD card, go to um, USB storage. Uh, so this is my one hour SD card. So go to DCIM camera one and then pick whatever you want to change to. So for today, I'm just going to use uh, this small file. So this, so you just hold on to the file and then you quickly select whatever you need, copy, and then go to internal storage, go to your instant 360 one hour app. Go to Gallery Original, go to Camera 1, and then copy here. So normally a file like this, uh, it will take me at least 2-3 to three minutes. But as you can see, we are able to transfer this file in like, I don't know, 15 seconds approximately. So now if I go back to my one hour app, just uh, refresh it, it's right there. So here you go guys. Um, I don't know if you, you know this already, but to me, this is an amazing discovery. I don't have to rely on Wi-Fi. Unfortunately, I'm not able to tell you if this works on iPhone or not. You, uh, you have an adapter, you can give it a try. But this will work on all Android devices. Uh, the app, the it, you may not use my file, but you might use a different app, but the idea is the same. You go to, as long as you put in your, um, your uh, SD card, uh, into your phone, it will read it and you just need to copy it into the one hour folder and, uh, and then it will work. So I hope you find this video, uh, useful. I'm not a professional YouTuber, YouTuber by any means. Uh, I just want to make this video for everybody, uh, because I found it really frustrating using Wi-Fi. So hope you like it. Bye.